Entonces, en la 3 dice, my customers complain that my Could service are late saved. delivering uh -huh. food. Entonces, the manager Ajá. en este caso va. Voy. De manager. De manager. Qué calor. De manager. Ajá. De manager. Pudo haber, en este caso, haber rotado los, haber rotado los meseros, quizás. A ver qué. Rotado o cambiado. Mm. Pudiera Pero ser, ¿verdad? Ok. Tres minutos ya. Sí, sí, sí. Okay. Sí, sí, sí. My customer complain. Complain. Eh, ¿Cómo seguir rotar? Rotar. Uh -huh. Rotate. Será rotate. Rotar. Uh -huh. eh, rotate. Rotate. Pero como es. En uh -huh. pasado participio. En pasado participio. ¿no? Es regular. O cambiar. Es regular. Es regular. No, es regular. Yeah. Ah, pues sería yeah. rotate. Yeah. Rotate. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Ok, ok, ok. Thank you. Ok. okay. Thank you, teacher. Ok. Excuse. Um, sería. La, podríamos poner las, los horarios de los meseros. Yes. Yeah. E, 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 X, X, C, C de casa, U, C de casa, así, U, uh -huh. Uy. Excuses. me voy a copiar a su sí. hermanita, puede ya. ser, ah, sí. <ríe> la escucho, <ríe> eh, eh, ahí, ahí, ahí queda, the manager could have rotated the, the schedule, el, el gerente podría haber rotado el horario. Manager, the manager who have offered excuses. Pero después de manager es who have. Ok. Who have. I know. I know. Ahí. Give me. Eh, 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 eh. De letra M, please. Es Q, C de casa, O, U, L, D. Q, eh. help. Slow, por please. Más lento, <risa> por. Ahí está arriba, Nelson. En las demás oraciones lo tienes. The manager could have, tienes arriba, por ejemplo, en el número dos. En el número ah. uno, the manager could have. Es the same. Uh, yes, yeah, yes. Yeah. Ya. Have. Offer. Ah, sí. Excuse. Offer. 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 Okay. Score. Yes, yes, yes. Score. Excuse. Excuse. And. Point. And. In, 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 in given. Y le dio. Given. Oh, oh. Le dio eh, discount. 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 Discord. Given. Yeah. Yes. It's okay. It's a past okay. participle of give. It's okay. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Uh, number four. Number four is um, el gerente de la cocina. Está sacando. De manera sub. Ah, está Ajá. tomando eh, unas cosas de, de la bodega. Sacó. Y sin paz. Se, se llevó. Ah, sí, sacó. Se llevó. Se llevó unas cosas de la bodega, ¿ok? Sí. 
Vale. It's grand. It's big. Problem. What is? What is the manager? What do? pero ya le escribí Guten con él. Serio. Arrepentimiento, dice. Ah, sí, ¿no? ¿Ah? no, porque ese es remordimiento, remor. Porque miente de culpa, entonces está arrepentida. Yes, but, but the manager should have talked with the employee. Mm -hmm. In the number four, number five, number the five. schedule is mess. Yeah. It's very difficult uh, or for some to understand. It. Ah, it's organized. It's necessary. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Employee, mm. um, en la anterior, ¿Sí? employee, um, el jefe de cocina ha estado sacando cosas de la bodega o algo así. Ajá, sí. Ah, tú. A, 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 a este sí hay que ponerle la cámara entonces, para ver. <risa> a este sí. A este sí podría ser. Yes. Tú, es, no sé cómo lo escribe. No me la tradujo, creo que le escribí. Ah, tomó cosas, dice tú, qué estúpida. Ajá. Ah, ok. Ah, pues sí, definitivamente. <ríe> The manager. Ajá. The manager. The manager. Cool. Eh, Puede ser poner o, o, o colocar cámaras. Poner es pure. O colocar cámaras. Espérame. Colocar. Colocar cámaras en la cocina. I would say instalar. Yo diría instalar. Sí, porque me tira instalar porque me tira placa. Se me tira. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. What? Instalar todo. De paz. Instale. Instale. Correct. Instale. 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 Uh, give you a no sé qué más dice la oración. Dice the manager. Ah, entonces sería instalar cámaras in, in storage room. In storage room. In storage. Sí, the manager could help. A ver. Ah, the other, the other. They could. No, ese es, ese no puede ser igual a ese. Es could. Could have made. Made a daily. Made. 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 A daily report. Made. Daily. Daily. Lo voy a mandar. 
Al revés es así. Daily. Es que se lo voy a decir cómo se escribe. Report of what happening every day. Yes. Separelo ahí. Every day. Teacher. Hello, tell me. Teacher, estará bien. ¿Cuántas son las que, que debemos hacer? Que Dios no escuche. Just one for las each. Cinco. Just one for each situation, all right? So you are in number four or number five? Solo llevamos dos. Okay. Uh, they could have made a daily report of what happened every de, day, yeah. De cada question. Um, One. Sería do, dos situaciones. No, no. Situation. Only one sentence or one repent or remorse for, for remorse for each sentence. Es una, pa, es una para cada oración. Es que Azalea dijo que por qué hacer solo una si con dos One. era mejor. Ah, no, it's okay, no problem, it's better. The idea is to practice. La idea okay. es practicar. Y si hacen dos o una, está bien. La idea es que practiquen la estructura. The idea okay. is to practice the structure. That's okay, no, not a problem. Okay, don't worry. No se preocupen. Okay. There's no problem. Okay? Entonces, okay, number three. <laughs> no, en, en, entonces, en, entonces, haga una, una y una, hagamos una y una de las que restan, para no hacer más. Okay. Pero estaba bien así porque así le entendíamos más, fíjese. Sí, es cierto. ¿Verdad? Le, ent le entendió no más, Rafael. Yes, thank you. It's okay. it's okay, the idea is to practice, okay? The idea is to practice. La idea es practicar. The idea is to practice. That's okay. Tal vez sale la tercera. Tal vez sale la tercera. No, no, no. Bien malo. No, me dio que el tiempo ya está finalizando. Ya no me da la cabeza ahorita. I gave you 10 minutes. I gave you 10 extra minutes. Le di 10 minutos extra. I gave you 10 extra oh, minutes. Right, right. Yeah. Oh my God. Lo que pasa es que no lo entendíamos bien, pero al final lo logramos. That's the most important. Es lo más importante. That's the most important. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Ok. Eh, no le tomé foto, pero bueno, así que quede. <laughs> No, pues no, te la voy a mandar. Ah, ok. Ok, everyone. I guess, um, I guess some, some of you hadn't finished. Right? Teacher, yo no escucho nada, teacher. ¿Los demás escuchan? ¿The others listen? Sí, teacher, yes. escuchamos. Ah, ok. Yes, teacher. Ok, pretty good. Ok, thank you. Is your connection probably, Ingrid? Ok, uh, so... Probably uh, some groups didn't finish, but don't worry. Don't worry. No se preocupen. Don't worry. Okay. Don't worry about that. Okay. So um, let me see. Uh, Rosa. Okay. Rosa and Rafael. Number one. Okay. Situation number one. Uh, let's see. Osmin and Ada. Hola, 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 hola. Hello, Osmin and Ada, situation number two. Okay? Yeah. Yes? Yeah. Um, Hi, Ingrid. Darwin and hello, Ingrid. Okay. ¿Me uh, escucha, Ingrid? Darwin and, 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 and okay. Angela. Darwin and Angela, situation number three. All right? Okay. Miguel. And and on on on. Let me see here. And Sandra. No estaba en el mismo grupo. No. No teacher. No. no. All right. So Miguel and Sandra. Situation number four. Number four. But, y a los que no he mencionado tienen para la situación cinco. Do you have for situation number five? The ones I didn't mention. Los que no mencioné. Anybody? No. You didn't finish number five. No? Okay. So it's okay with four situations, okay? So let's listen carefully, please. We are going to listen uh, 
to the to, to what the manager could have done all right vamos a escuchar qué pudo haber hecho el manager or what he should have done all right so uh let me show you here okay so uh rosa money disappeared from the register machine so tell us uh, the manager could have made a cash register oh the manager could have made a cash Register. Yes, yes, totally. Okay, to check, right? Who was taking the money? I like yes. it. Okay, okay, let's see, Rafael. The same, Rafael. Um, the manager would have indicated the, that they look, look the register machine. Can you repeat it, please? He will have indicator that they look the register machine okay so the manager could have indicated that they were looking for the register machine yes. okay okay i like it i like it very good okay or they, they were searching for the uh, register machine okay i like it thank you very much uh, in this case rafa you don't say would okay you say could or choose only okay would it's different okay because you were saying would so could or should in this case okay could have indicated or should have indicated okay thank you rosa and rafa situation number two someone broke three bottles of the best wine in the restaurant but none of the servers has reported the issue osmin yeah yes teacher okay the manager should have reported the problem immediately Oh, the manager should have reported reported the problem immediately. Okay, thank you, Osmin. Yes. Immediately, thank yes. you. That's very good. Ada, what do you have? The manager could have seen the security camera. Them, I good. So the manager could have seen or checked the security cameras. I like it. I like that idea. Okay, um, good. Thank you, Osmin and Ada. Situation number three. My customers complained that my servers took too long to deliver the food. Darwin. Okay, the, the manager could have hired a new server. Oh my goodness. <laughs> so the manager could have hired or contracted new servers. Oh my goodness, <laughs> He's, this Darwin is very strict, right? <laughs> You're very strict, Darwin. Okay, let's listen to Angela with the same situation. Situation number three, Angela. The manager should have a um, I, I have problem teacher with accent. Respuesta. <laughs> it's difficult. Try, try. No, no, no. Um, the manager should have um, 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 a moment, teacher. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> um, and maybe in this, in, for this sentence, you can say the manager could have trained. Hubiera trained. capacitado. Okay. Yes, Pudo haber tra capacitado. Could yes, have yes, trained, trained the, the server. The server. The servers, that's right. Okay. okay. Pudo okay. haber capacitado. Could have trained the, the servers, okay? The server, okay. Yes. Okay, thank you, Angela and Darwin. Situation number four. The kitchen manager took stuff from the storage room, okay? El gerente de cocina se llevó algunas cosas de la bodega. Okay, let's listen to Miguel. Okay. Uh, the manager could have suspend the kitchen manager for one day. All right. Suspend or suspended? Suspended. Ah, suspended because it's in past suspended. participle, right? Yes, yes. Repeat, this, repeat the sentence, please. The manager could have suspend, suspended. suspended. Suspended the kitchen manager for one day. For one day. All right. To learn for him to learn the lesson. Okay. Thank you, Miguel. I like it. Thank okay. You. Sandra, the same, same situation. Number four, Sandra. Okay. Manager could have. Installed someone camera in a storage room. Oh, the manager could have installed some cameras in the storage 
room. room. Okay, room. Good. That's excellent. Very good. So I can see you have very good solutions, okay, for the manager. Okay, now listen. Uh, the idea here in this activity was to use should have and could have, right? Yes, the idea was to use should have and could have. Okay? But for remorse, para remorse también usamos la estructura de si yo hubiese hecho tal cosa, habría. If I had, for example, if I had installed cameras, si hubiese instalado cameras, okay, uh, the kitchen manager wouldn't have taken staff. Okay? El gerente de cocina no habría, no se habría llevado cosas de la, de, de la bodega, okay? The kitchen manager wouldn't or would not have taken stuff from the storage uh, room, okay? So we have this situation, which is for remorse, que es más como para remordimiento, okay? Yeah? Okay, for example, you can say, if I had trained the servers, if I had trained the servers, si hubiese entrenado a los camareros, uh, they would have been faster. Ellos habrían sido más rápidos. They would have been, they would have been faster. Okay? Que been is the past participle of be. Okay? Yeah, so it's, most, it's mostly for remorse. Esta estructura es mayormente para remordimiento, for remorse. Okay? Yeah? So do you have any question before we go to the next part? Any questions before we go to the next part? No, teacher. No, I think everything no. is okay, right? You practice a lot, okay? So thank you very much, okay? Thank you for teacher, your- Teacher, you can Sorry? When they use the word? Number five? Yeah, example, I asked. For example, oh. number four, the manager should, should have talked with the employee and warns him, him that is, is does, does it again? She would fight him. All right, and if and if he does it again, uh, she uh, should have um, fired him. Okay, yeah, it's okay, it's fine, it's okay. I like it, Nelson. It's good. It's a good option. Okay. okay? Thank you very much. Uh, alguien más iba a decir algo? Somebody else was going to say something. Number yes, five. Teacher. Yes, Asalia. It's not number five. Yes, I was asking, okay, uh, who has number five? Y nadie dijo nada, nadie dijo que tenía algo para las cinco. So do you have something, Asalia, for number five? ¿Tienes algo para el número yes. cinco? Yes, okay, let's listen to Asalia. Yes. So, li listen, Asalia. First, the situation is, um, the schedule is a mess, and it is very difficult for staff to understand it. So, Asalia, what do you have? The boss called how? Made a more definite and clear schedule. Good. He should have made the manager, right? The manager should have made a more definite and clear schedule. I like it. It's a good option. Thank you very much. Okay. Okay, everyone. So please go to reactions and give these brave people a wow, a heart, or whatever you want, okay? Whatever. Whatever you want, a heart, a wow, congratulations, all right, a like, yeah. <laughs> okay, thank you very much for your participation in this activity, for the ones who participated. Thank you very much. Creo que pasaré asistencia antes de ir a la siguiente actividad para seguirte una vez. Yes, it's three to nine. Um, lo siento, pero... Lo siento, pero lo voy a, nos vamos a quedar un poquito más, ¿ok? Porque mmm, se me fue la luz y perdí como, perdí como seis minutos. Perdí como seis minutos, se fue la electricidad, ¿ok? Acá. Cuando estaba en grupos. Cuando estaba en grupos no se dieron cuenta. When you were in groups, ¿ok? So, um, así que si llegamos hasta las diez y diez ahí, ¿ok? So, don't, don't, don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> no you. problem, teacher. Thank you, Natalia. Thank you for your sincerity. <laughs> no problem, teacher. No problem. Okay. I, I me voy a dormir y me despierto. Okay, I will. I will definitely. I will. Okay, let's pass the attendance. Yes, okay. I will do it. Okay, let's see. Ada. Here. Adriana. Um, Ana Michelle? 
Oh, present. She's saying present on the chat. Angela? <laughs> present teacher. Darwin? Present teacher. Flor? Flor? It seems I saw Flor connected. No, right. She's not connected. Gloria? Here. Joanna? She's connected, I think. She was connected. Okay, Lourdes? I'm here, teacher. Okay. Margarita? Present. Okay, Mayra? Present. Miguel? Present. Nelson? Present. Ofelia? Here, teacher. Osmin? Present, teacher. Present. Okay, Rafael. Present. Rosa. Present. Okay. Uh, Present. Sandra. Present teacher. Yancy. Present. Zulma. Present. Azalia. Present. Uh, Ingrid. Present teacher. And Susana. Present. Okay, thank you very much. Okay. Okay, uh, so let's continue then uh, with um, yeah, just quickly, okay? Ya todos terminaron el trabajo de la plataforma. Did everyone finish the platform work? Lo que estamos yes, acá? Teacher. Yes, yes. Margarita, yes, ya. Yes, Margarita, ya está? Yes, number three. Yes, Margarita, ya está la sección tres. Sí, teacher, ya está. Okay, thank you very much. Okay, todos terminaron ya la sesión tres. Everyone? Yes, teacher. Yes, okay, thank you yes, very much. Teacher. Okay, thank you. Okay, uh, so let's go to the next part. And in the next part, we have a reading, okay? We have a short uh, reading, okay? Oh, yeah, it's somehow short, okay? De alguna forma es corta, it's somehow short. Okay, listen. With this reading, we are going to do three things. Okay, we are going to kill three birds with one shot. Vamos a matar tres pájaros de un solo tiro. Okay, we are going to kill three birds with one shot. Okay, I will give you the pronunciation. So you listen carefully to the pronunciation. I will pronounce the, the article twice. Voy a pronunciarlo dos veces. So pay attention to pronunciation. Si hay alguna palabra que les cueste, escriban. Okay, write it, please. Then, then you will go to working groups like in groups of two or three, okay? And first, la primera cosa que van a hacer, first thing you are doing, you will answer these questions, okay? Van a contestar estas preguntas. You will answer these questions, okay? First activity. Second activity in the groups, you are going to pronounce the article. Van a pronunciar. You are going to pronounce the, the article, okay? Van a pronunciar el artículo. And three, you will check new vocabulary. Van a buscar nuevo vocabulario y lo van a traducir. You will check new vocabulary and you will check the meaning, okay? So three activities. Activity number one. What is activity number one? Pronunciation. Okay. You can change, okay? So, okay, let's say activity number one, pronunciation. Activity number two, New, new vocabulary. You answer the question. You answer the question. In activity number three, you can check the new vocabulary. Okay? Yeah? Yes. Or you can change. O pueden cambiar. First, you pronounce. Second, you check the vocabulary. Para que ya cuando vayan a contestar las preguntas, ya sepan más o menos el vocabulario. So you know the vocabulary a little bit. Okay? Yeah? Okay. So, first, okay. pronunciation. Second, vocabulary. Third, answer the questions, okay? So you will work in groups. Okay, so let's go to the pronunciation first. Vamos a la pronunciación primero. So please, um, so please pay attention to the pronunciation carefully. And if you don't know a word, please write it. Si no saben cómo pronunciar una palabra, le escriben, okay? So listen, please, listen carefully. Most of the public discussion of surveillance technology and its use revolves around the question, is it spooky or reassuring? 
but a different issue is the effect of surveillance on behavior. And a new research paper shows in detail how significant the surveillance effect can be. The researchers measure the impact of software that monitors employee level theft and sales transactions before and after the technology was installed at 392 restaurants in 39 states. Employee theft and fraud is a big problem, estimated at up to $200 billion a year across the economy. Most of the restaurant industry pays its servers low wages and they depend on tips. Employee replacement is high. In that environment, a certain amount of theft has long been regarded as a normal part of the business. A simple example is a bartender not charging for a round of drinks and urging the customers to take care of me with a large tip. Other tactics are more elaborate. But monitoring software is now available to track all transactions and detect suspicious patterns. After the installation of the monitoring software, income per restaurant increased by an average of $2,982 a week. Knowing they were being monitored, the servers not only pulled back on any unethical practices, but also channeled their efforts into, say, prompting customers to have that dessert on a, or a second beer. Listen again, please. Listen again carefully. Most of the public discussion of surveillance technology and its use revolves around the question, is it spooky or reassuring? But a different issue is the effect of surveillance on behavior. In a new research paper shows in detail how significant the surveillance effect can be. The, the researchers measure the impact of software that monitors employee level theft and sales transactions before and after the technology was installed at 392 restaurants in 39 states. Employee theft and fraud is a big problem, estimated at up to $200 billion a year across the economy. Most of the restaurant industry pays its servers low wages and they depend on tips. Employee replacement is high. In that environment, a certain amount of theft has long been regarded as a normal part of the business. A simple example is a bartender not charging for a round of drinks and urging the customers to take care of me with a large tip. Other tactics are more elaborate. But monitoring software is now available to track all transactions and detect suspicious patterns. After the installation of the monitoring software, income per restaurant increased by an average of $2,982 a week. Knowing they were being monitored, the servers not only pulled back on any unethical practices, but also channeled their efforts into say, prompting customers to have that dessert or a second beer. Okay, three activities. Activity number one, pronunciation. So you take turns, toman turnos, okay? Activity number two, checking new vocabulary. Activity number three, answering the questions, okay? Contestar las preguntas, so any questions? This article is on page 31, it's in the page 31, it's on page number 31. So do you have any questions? No, this is clear. No, okay, please. listen, listen, listen carefully. 10 minutes for pronunciation. Alguien que lleve el control del tiempo. 10 minutes for pronunciation, okay? 10 minutes, okay. Yes, toman turnos, you take turns, okay? 10 minutes for 
checking vocabulary. Yes? And yes, 10 minutes sir. and 10 minutes to answer the questions. Ten, yeah? ten, ten. So yeah. please con control the time. Controlling el tiempo. Alguien que lo lleve. Put a timer, please. Asignen una persona que lleve el tiempo. Put a timer. 10 minutes yeah. for pronunciation. 10 minutes for checking new vocabulary, porque tenemos bastante nuevo vocabulario, ¿ok? And 10 minutes for answering the questions, ¿ok? Ah, 45 minutos. Yes, no, yes. 30, 30, 30 minutes. No 45, <laughs> 30, no 45, ¿ok? 30 minutos, okay. 30. Minutes, 30. <laughs> okay, any questions? Minutes, ok, ok, ok. <laughs> any questions? No questions? No, teacher. No, all right, so let's go to practice then. Yes, teacher, thank okay. you. Ok, ok. <laughs> Entonces, el teacher. ¿Quién puede presentar? Hello. Me el... Hello. Hello. ¿Pueden o no pueden? Sí. No. Hasta le empieza usted. ¿Yo qué? Y no, no lo vamos a poner ahí. No, no está. Ah, no tiene, no tiene. Ah, yo porque ya lo manché. Yo tengo el, el folleto, pero Muy ya lindo. lo ya manché. El, espérame. En la, en la, el libro aquí lo tengo. Aquí yo lo, espérame. Mm, ahorita lo voy a compartir. Esta es la 31. Uh -huh. yes. Si no empecemos aquí con el libro impreso. Vale. A ver aquí. O oh, si no, sentía que me parecía un niño en el cuarto de mi papá. No me deja compartir. Me deja voltear la cámara. Ah, se está, se está compartiendo usted. Bueno, sí, lo quiero compartir yo, pero no me deja. No quiero mucho. ¿Ahorita? Si no, veamos aquí para no perder el tiempo. Bernardo. Hello. Aquí está. I'm here. Si quiere, yo creo que ya, ya pude, creo. No tienen el manual. No, está... no tienen ah, el ahorita manual. Esto. Yo lo sí, voy a compartir claro. ahorita. No, no, yo lo quise compartir, pero no, ya no me dejó, quizás no, porque estaba, ajá, no estaba inglés. Compartiendo. 
Deje yo de lo compartir. Marqué, pero... No sé si le sale. Deje de compartir para compartir yo el. No me Bye. voy. Dígale que se vaya a dormir. No, como no. Sí, 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 ahorita. Sí. No puedo compartir. Ingrid, creo que le ha dado compartir pantalla, que por eso no, no podemos. Ya estuvo, ya. Ya estuvo, ya me sale. Ok. Ya me salí. Se trabó. ¿Cuál voy? Ay, por la 20. Ya me Voy a sacar. Ahí me pasé. ¿Dónde tienen el folleto ustedes? Perfecto. Ahorita. Ya lo pueden ver. Sí. Vaya, un párrafo cada una. <risa> ¿Qué es en inglés? Okay. You start. Yeah. Yo porque yo lo tengo, yo lo tengo aquí, pero no sé si ustedes lo tienen ahí impreso. Ahí uh -huh. Vaya, ¿quién empieza? Usted. <ríe> yo. <ríe> Ok, pues. Vaya. Sería, most of the public this. Ay, mire, me va a tener presente porque me pongo nervioso. Vaya. Most eh, of the public eh, this. Dissertion. Eh, of. ¿Cómo se pronuncia esta? Teacher, ¿cómo se pronuncia esta? Survey. 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 Surveillance. 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 Ah, surveillance. Ah, surveillance. Surveillance technology and its use reserved uh, ar um, around the question. Is it a spot uh, of result? Como es restauring? Restauring, es verdad. Reassuring. 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 Uh, but the difference uh, of the death after you. Eh, surveillance um, viewer and the new research behavior. ¿Cómo es? Behavior. Paper show. Uh, paper show and the lead and significant uh, the surveillance effect can, can be. This recent uh, research. research Missouri, the impact the software, the monetary, monetary, employed labor, and the and sales transactions before and after the technology was installed at um, 392 restaurant in Thirsty Nice States. Ay, toda me trabe, pero. Employees, this and fun is a big problem. Estimate that to, to 200 billion a year across the, the economy. Most of the restaurant industry pay its service long ways and they depend on tips. On tips, employees replacement replacement is high in in that every rotman a certain amount of this as has long been regarded regarded 
as a normal part of the business. A simple example is a bartender no, not shirking for a round of drink and urging the customer to take care of me with a low tip other tactics are more uh, elaborate. But monitoring software is now about available to track all transactions and detect suspicious patterns after the installation of the monitoring software. Income per restaurant increases by an average of Two million nine eight two. No, no, se cosa se dice, teacher. Two thousand. A week. Two thousand. <laughs> two thousand. Two thousand. Nine hundred. Nine hundred. Okay. Nine hundred. Nine hundred eight two. Eighty two. Eighty two. Thirty two. A week knowing they were being monitored, the service not only pulled or pulled. 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 Pulled back on any on it or technical practice, but all channel their effort into, say, prompting customer to have that desert or a second beer. 10 minutos terminados. Go to the next part, vocabulary. Okay. Um, Alguien que le lleve el tiempo, somebody, o si no, no van a terminar. If not, you won't finish, okay? Okay. Resorting. Para mí, for me, is. Other word? For uh, me? Reassuring. Ah, reassuring. 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 Tranquilizador. Me sale a mí. Está bien. Okay. It's okay. O reconfortante. Confortante puede ser. Reconfortante, perdón. For me, spooky. Ah. Spooky es escalofriante. Escalofriante, sí. Espeluznante, Desde... por Ajá, Sería entonces escalofriante o. Espeluznante. ¿Qué significa? Es peluznante. Es como cosa fear, que causa miedo. Y cosa fear, ¿ok? Mm -hmm. Something spooky causes fear. Por ejemplo, you can say, that house was very spooky, que causa miedo, ¿ok? Spooky, right? A spooky house. O a spooky person. ¿Ok? Other word, measure. 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 Ok. Esa es medida, ¿no? Sí. Quiero ver cómo está. Behavior. 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 Ajá, behavior. Eso significa. Ah, es comportamiento. Behavior. Yes. Behavior. Es comportamiento. Um, ah, bueno, esta es. Fraud. 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 Uh -huh. Fraud. Fraud. Uy, no, no veo esa. ¿Dónde está? Fraud. En dice con párrafo, ¿cómo se dice? Paragraph. Paragraph, second paragraph. Employee, ah, deaf and proud. Okay. 
there, there. Otra, ah, otra lista de text es hurto también. ¿Cuál? Este? Es que dice eh, employee, test and pro. Ah, test. Ah. es como, creo que como robo, hurto o algo así. Ajá. Ajá. Entonces, el, el iría es... junto a la idea, Tisha. Fraud and fraud, death and fraud. Fraud, fraude, fraude. Ajá. Entonces sería roba, robo Probe. y fraude. Robo y fraude Robo y es fraude. un gran problema. Wait, wait. This uh, across the country, well, most of restaurant industry pays its server low wage. wages. 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 Because it's plural. Yeah, wages. Wages. Mm. Yeah. It's a salary. Es la siguiente pregunta. Uh, salarios. Abajo salarios. Uh -huh. Y dependen de las propinas. Uh -huh. Environment también, ¿verdad? En, en, environment es ambiente. ¿Medio ambiente? ¿Environment? Medio ambiente. Medio ambiente. Ya le digo. Are you sure? Sí. Sí. Yes. Ok. En replacement. 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 Ah, ya lo vi. Employee replacement. Ah, no sé. Ah, qué replacement. Replacement. Reemplazo. Reemplazo, ok. Ajá, reemplazo. In, in this okay. case, I would say reemplazados. Because it's, uh -huh. in, it's in past, right? Yeah. Ok. Ajá, reemplazados. Reemplazados. Yeah. Sharking. Is a past teacher? Yes, in which sentence is it? I remember I saw it. Oh, sorry. It's, yeah, yeah, it's a noun, sorry. Employee replacement, right? Uh -huh. Yes, you're right. Tienen razón. Es reemplazo de empleados. Uh -huh. Yes, reemplazo. It's okay. Está bien. I'm sorry. It's okay. Okay. Other tactics? Tact tactics? Así es, tactics. 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 Táctica. Táctica. Sí. Ok. También la de yeah. regard. Certain, certain is como un cierto, un cierto monto, o como. Uh -huh. O no. Yeah. yeah. Um, Def that. Uh, regarder, regarder. Esa es eh, considerar, considerado. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Como una parte normal del negocio. Ok. Ya lo dijo Rosa, que es hurto. Tef. Tef. Oigo, oigo como un. Como un eco del teacher. Tef. Algo le parece al teacher. Ok, ok. Cuando, cuando escucho hablar al teacher o alguien que sabe pronunciar inglés, lo siento tan fácil. Ya cuando me toca a mí es muy difícil. Practice makes perfect. Practice yes, makes perfect. Como diría algún día, hablaré. One day, someday. One day. Yeah, you can say some, someday, some. 
Sunday wages, eh, speaking wages, wages, perfect wages. English. This Miguel, wages. this another this <laughs> wages. Wages. Yes. Okay, excellent. This this is ways and then you can pay with speak and then I have to erase. Oh my god. Rosa, I'm what are you to doing? Erase my mistake. Okay. <laughs> what are you doing, Rosa? <laughs> and now there is um, replacement 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 okay okay replacement okay mm -hmm. normal um, part of the business simple example is for them but I'm not showing you Regarding, Okay, take um, care. Or well, tactics are more tactics, elaborate. Tactics, como tácticas. Tácticas, yes, yes, yes. This is casi similar. Well, the maintenance of what is called a viable, a viable, the track transaction and detect suspicious. Increase. Me imagino que la palabra es pull it back. Pull it back. Es, es, mm -hmm. ajá, es, es ambas. It's like pull back. Pull it 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 back. Pull Unérico. Okay, Unérico. 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 No, no, ah, I don't know. It's efforts. effort. Effort. Oh. Esfuerzo. 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 Ah, okay. Esfuerzo. Mm -hmm. no, okay. No, Veamos entonces no. cuáles no conocemos sí. o quién conoce algunas. Todas. Las... Ah, surveillance <laughs> es vigilancia. <laughs> ¿no? Vigilancia. Vigilancia. Okay. Aquí Spooky. tengo que aprender aunque sea uno. Well, it's el robo. Spooky es. Oh, oh my God. God. ¿Qué dice Nelson? Hola. Tip, tip, el robo. Ah, sí. Furto, tef, ah, furto. Tef, tef. Ah, pero, pero este es Spooky, o sea, okay. orden. Yeah, yeah. Spooky, yo encontré que era algo escalofriante. Ah, sí, escalofriante. Yo como escalofriante. Pero... Creo que sí. Escalofriante, ok. Or resourcing. Or... ¿Qué es esto? Reassuring. Reassuring. Es que reassuring. No, ahí está. Reassuring. 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 Teacher. Teacher, díganos qué es esto. Es tranquilizador, 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 creo que era. Ah, okay. Ajá, reconfortante, tranquilizador, Ajá, reassuring. reassuring. Ok. Issue es este, incidente, ¿verdad? Problem. No, asunto. Incidente, problema, no sé. Y dijimos que surto, yeah. fraude, ¿qué yeah. es? Fraude. Así como fraude. Sí. Fraude. Wesh, ¿cuál es? ¿Qué es wesh? Wesh son salarios. 
Wedges. In plural is wedges. 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 Salarios. Wedges. Ah, salarios. 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 Ok. Displacement es reemplazando. Así que. O sea, uh -huh. por eso está entre comillas. Ajá, uh -huh. take care of me. Of me. Uh -huh. Ok. Number five. What was the increase of, in of income after the installation of monitoring software? What was the increase? ¿Cuál es el aumento? El, el incremento. El incremento de ingresos. Después de la Ajá. instalación de monitoreo. Ah, sería 2,982. 82. Income. Ajá, increase by an average. Pongámosle was, was two hundred, two eh, thousand. No es fue o was, was. Ajá, was. A week. Was. Increase. Diferente. Sí, two Dólar. Dólares. Uh -huh. Dólares. Es después dólar a quit. A quit. Uh -huh. A week. Uh -huh. A week. 2.982 en la semana. Uh -huh. Ok. Ok. Um, 9.182. What was the change behavior? Y de estar hasta de esa época, la última. Uh -huh. ¿Cuál fue el cambio en el comportamiento en el grupo de después del monitoreo de software que fue instalado? Dice, uh -huh. pero dice... After the installation of the monitoring software, Income per restaurant increased by a uh half. -huh. Después dice, knowing they were being monitored. Being es como estando monitoreado. ¿va? Fueron algo así. Fueron, ellos estuvieron como monitoreados. Uh -huh. Los meseros estaban, no estaban siempre. Siendo, estaban siendo ah, monitoreados. Siendo. Estaban siendo okay. monitoreados. Okay? They were being monitored. Estaban, Gracias. Ok. Los, los meseros no solo pull es empujar, ¿verdad? Pull back. Empujar. Pull back. Pero the word is pull back. La palabra es pull back. Pull back. Es un phrasal verb. Mm -hmm. Ok. Ok. Voy a buscar qué es pull back. Yo creo que como dice, ¿cuál fue el cambio que el personal después después de ser monitoreados claro. era que ellos ofrecían un postre y dos cervezas? Sería prompting customer to help. Mm, pull back es como dar marcha atrás o retirarte. 
Yes, it's okay. Thank you. Va, entonces, the answer is uh, the servers uh, not only pull back. Uh, on any no, pero no solo dice dieron marcha atrás. Not only dice. Sobre... Only. No solo. Uh -huh. eh, ah, ajá. Dice no solo. Any ethical practices. Como sobre algún no, o, o sobre dice. ninguna práctica que no es ética. Yes. Pero es lo que estaban haciendo y también pusieron Desert on second beer. Uh -huh. Dice, me acuerdo que dijeron el significado de prompting, pero ya se me olvidó. Eh, como prontamente, creo que era. Oh, eh, provocaron. Provocar in this case. Ah, ok. Provocaron en los clientes eh, tener un. un Pedir, a usted pedir, pedir un postre o una segunda, o una segunda cerveza. Mm. Eso es lo que hicieron, ¿verdad? Sorry. Eso es lo que hicieron, ¿verdad? Yes. El cambio que Yeah, they had the change in ethics, right? In ethical practices. Uh -huh. Y aparte del cambio, también metieron más, más producto. Okay? They offer more product. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yes. Vale, entonces sería, <clears throat> what was the change in behavior? Um, the servers, pongamos, not only pull back on any unethical practice. Not. Um, um, only pull it back. Pull it back. Back. Um, 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 o sea que la, la respuesta sería desde donde dice the server. Uh -huh. uh -huh. uh -huh. Sí. Y, y vamos a poner lo que sigue, channel day, force, into, todo eso. 392. Yes. What is the estimated cost of employee debt and fraud up to 200 billion a year? What is a fraud tactic used by bartender? Bartender not charging for a round of drinks. What was the increase of income after the installation of the monitoring software? Increased by an average of 2,982 a week. What was the what was the change in behavior in the staff after the monitoring software was installed? The servers not only put it back on any unethical practices, but also channel their effort into say prompting customers to have that dessert or a second beer creo que ahí terminamos ya todas le voy a dar un poquito más de tiempo porque algunos no han terminado unos okay. cuatro minutos pueden pronunciar si gustan you can pronounce if you want okay ok teacher ok a ver, veamos, solo voy a borrar este. Bye. No sé quién quiere iniciar, chicos. Es... Si gustan, inicio yo. Ok. Ok. Most of the public discussion of surveillance technology and it is use resolve around the question 
is it spooky or restoring? But a different issue is the effect of surveillance on behavior. And a new research paper shows in detail how significant the surveillance effect can be. The research, teacher, ¿cómo se pronuncia? Measured. 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 Okay. Measured. The research measured the impact of software that monitors employee level, depth, and sales transaction before and after the technology was installed at 382 restaurants in 39 states. Okay, employees. Ah, okay, excuse me. No, siga, yo sigo el otro. Okay, thanks. Employees, chef, and problem is big problem. It's made a up to 100 billion a year across the economy. Most of the restaurant industry fight deep service low wage and they depend of it. Employees replacement is high in that a uh, development as they among of share has long been figured as a normal part of the business. A simple example, these are the tender not charging for a round of swing and using the customer to take care of me with a large fit. All the taxes are more elaborated. Okay. I bus monthly. So where is not I bargaining? I do tax or transaction and debt suspension a panther after I des installation of the monitoring software in common per restaurant ingredient I be in a very os eh, 2982 I we I I I know we days were this monitor I did reserve I know we purchase bus on any unity car practice bus also channel I dare effort intro such prompting customer to has that desert or the second bid. Okay, finish. Thank you. Gracias. Le tomaron captura, chicos, a las respuestas sí. de las preguntas. Sí. No, sí, a las respuestas no las tomé. Es... Richard, I need 10 minutes. <laughs> finish, um, to finish. On to tomorrow. Yes, lo que vamos a, a hacer después. <laughs> no, I actually, I gave you, I gave you eight extra minutes, all right? I gave yes, you yes, yes, nine, yes. eight extra minutes. But, so, but it was very interesting, teacher. Yes, yes teacher. We, we were talking and talking. And talking. Yes, <laughs> we, we're learning a lot, uh, a lot of. And yes. we didn't answer anything. <laughs> oh my goodness. No, but that, that's okay. It's part of the process. It's part of learning. Okay. okay, so that's okay. No problem. Okay, so if you learn vocabulary, if you learn pronunciation, I mean, it's okay. No problem. Yes. Okay, if you didn't yes. answer the questions. Okay. Thank you, okay. Don't worry. Don't worry. I will give you the answers. Okay. So listen, uh, we are going to do something uh, to check, right? Uh, to check, I am going to show you the answers. Okay. In question number one and in question number six, you can have different answers, okay? Answers can be different. Las respuestas pueden variar. Answers can vary, okay? For question number one and for question number six, okay? So let me show you the answers and you compare your answers with my answers, okay? Comparan sus respuestas con las mías. You compare your answers with mine 
answers, okay? This is just to compare, okay? And to see if your answers are correct, okay? So let's see, veamos, let's see. Okay, so uh, so for question uh, for question number one is why do people think surveillance is considered spooky? The answer I have is surveillance might be considered an invasion to privacy. It represents to have one's life control, etc. So you can have another answer. Uh, for example, let's see um, let's see someone. Uh, let's see. Um, let me look for someone here. Uh, Nelson, what do you have in question number one? For example, why do people think surveillance is considered spooky? Well, bye. The, the microphone, Nelson, the microphone. Yes, the people is fear intimidator. Ah, because people can feel intimid intimidated or insecure. All right, yeah, that's fine, it's okay. Who has another answer? Quien tiene otra respuesta? Who has another answer? Me. Okay, go ahead. Because it's very uncomfortable. It's very uncomfortable. uncomfortable. Yes. Yes, it's right. Because it's very uncomfortable. That's right. It's correct. Okay, so we uncomfortable. We can have different answers, right? Good. Question number two. Question number two is how many restaurants were part of the research? So the answer is 392 restaurants. restaurants, right? 300 restaurants. Yes. In 39 states. Ah, in 39 states, that's right, okay? So we have the states even, good. Question number three. Question number three is, um, what is the estimated cost of the employee theft and fraud? $200 billion a year. Okay, that's the answer. The mayor, the mayor across the company. Across the economy. Across the economy. 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 The economy, exactly, the economy. economy Number four, yes. what is a fraud tactic used by bartenders? Ah, what is the tactic? Not charging customers charging for a fraud drinks. 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 Yes. in exchange for exchange a large tip. tip. Mm -hmm. That's yes. right. So, yes. so basically, bartenders, okay, uh, they don't charge customers, okay? No les cobran, okay? A uh, round yes. of drinks. And what is the purpose? To receive a large tip. Recibir una gran propina. 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 To receive a large tip. That's the purpose, okay? Question number five. What was the increase of income after the installation of the monitoring software? And the increase was an average of 2,982 a week per restaurant. Good. And the last answer. What was the change in behavior in the staff after monitoring software was installed? Well, you know that employees stop applying unethical values. Aquí pueden tener diferente el principio. You can have the, the, the beginning different, okay? So you can have, for example, employees not only, okay? Not only what? Employees not only, I think this is the answer you have, pull back on any unethical practices, tal vez eso tienen ustedes, okay? And started implementing upselling techniques. Or you can have la, la, you can have the answer like it is on the on the on the article, okay? Puede tener la respuesta como está en el, en el artículo literal también, okay? So you can have uh, you can have, for example, the servers not only pull back on any unethical practices, but also channel their effort channel into say prompting customers to have that dessert or a second beer. Okay. Beer. Beer or a yes. second. Beer. Okay. Thank you very much. Teacher, for your that, what's the meaning of upseller? What's the meaning upselling. of upseller? Upseller. Upselling. It's like selling. It's like a synonym for selling. It's like the same. It's like to, but, but to sell like, upsell is like to sell in a bigger quantity. Upsell. Okay. Sell is like normal, right? But upsell is like to, to overcome, all right? The, the, the expected sales. Yeah. Okay. Uh, very good. Now, uh, together, Together, I will pass the attendance a la 10 y 10, voy a pasar la asistencia, ¿ok? Yes, <laughs> but teacher, good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Good night, teacher. Yes, a marathon. I'm kidding, I'm kidding, it's not true. A la 10 y 9 se la voy a pasar, ¿ok? <laughs> no, teacher, no castigo. I'm sorry, it's only today. 
and tomorrow, and the day after tomorrow. <laughs> I believe you. I'm kidding. Mañana vamos a empezar a las ocho. Mañana vamos a empezar a las ocho y cuarto entonces. Merry Christmas, teacher. Y vamos a terminar a las diez y media. Thank you. Qué malo, qué malvado. It's a joke. Okay, so let's see quickly. Ah, so what new words did you find? ¿Qué nuevas palabras encontraron? What new words did you find? Surveillance, maybe? Surveillance. Surveillance. Revolves around. Reassurance. Reassurance. Spooky. What else? Behavior. Research. Researchers, okay. Researchers, measured, measured. Researchers, measured. Regarded. Yes. Regarded. Vamos en orden. Let's go in order. Theft. Theft. What else? Come on. Employee. Theft. Fraud, maybe. Fraud. Fraud. Environment. Environment. Uh, uh, no, este me estaba guiando, mira. Me estaba guiando, mira. Este me estaba guiando. Regarded, regarded, regarded. Sí, sí, sí. Regarded, regarded, urging. Sí, sí, sí. Sorry. 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 Oh, okay, so I have environment here. A certain, right? Certain amount. Yes, okay, thank yes, you. Yes. Good. Charging. Available. We have charging. Ya tenemos charging acá. Suspicious. Available. Suspicious. 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 And patterns, right? Patterns. Average. Increase. Increase. Average. Knowing. Pull back. Knowing. Knowing. Channeling. Channeling. Unethical. 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 Prompting. Prompting. Okay, that's in general, right? In general. Okay. Okay, now let's let's check. Prompting. Efforts. Efforts, teacher. Efforts. 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 Good. Now let's check. Ahora revisemos. Let's check. Um, okay, let's check. Now let's check. Uh, so for surveillance is vigilancia, right? Surveillance revolves around and it's used revolves around the question. Como que gira. En la pregunta, revolves around the question, okay? Spooky is like escalofriante, espeluznante, all right? Reassuring is like, um, I don't know, reconfortante, all right? Tranquilizador, yeah? Uh, researchers is investigadores, right? Researchers, okay? Uh, measured, miden, okay? O midieron, all right? Theft is robo or hurto, theft. Theft, the game, fraud, fraud, fraude, right? Uh, wages, low wages, es como salario bajos, okay? Low wages, yes, salario bajos. Environment, in that environment, en ese ambiente, okay? En esa atmósfera. Certain amount, una cantidad cierta, okay? O una cierta cantidad, sorry. Certain is cierta. Uh, regarded is like considerado. Regarded as a normal part, considerados como una parte normal, okay? Regarded is considerado. Charging is like cobrar, okay? Charging, not charging, sin cobrar, right? Available, available is disponible, of course. Suspicious, sospechoso. Patterns, patrones, okay? Patrones sospechosos. Suspicious patterns, okay? Pero no patrones de jefe, okay? So the, 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 the difference, the, is, there's a difference. Hay una diferencia, there's a difference. Increase is like incrementaron, average, promedio, right? Um, knowing is like sabiendo. Pull back, okay? Pull back is like retirarse, okay? Darse la baja de algo, okay? Pull back. Unethical, uh, no éticos, right? Prácticas no éticas, all right? Channel is like canalizar, channel, all right? Prompting is like provocar, okay? To provocar a alguien a hacer algo. So it's like pro prompting customers, provocar que los clientes. 
All right. So uh, this is the vocabulary uh, we have in this part. Okay. So this is the new vocabulary we have in this part. I don't know if um, do you have any doubts about this reading? Alguna duda? Any doubts about this reading? No doubts. Everything okay? Todo bien? Everything okay? Okay. Yes. Yes. Ah, más. yes. Kind of. Yes. We only have one more activity for today. Solo tenemos una actividad más. Okay. We only have one more activity for today. Uh, but first, pero primero déjenme pasar asistencia. Okay. Pero no se me vayan a salir, please. Don't go out, please. Okay. Solo hacemos una actividad más. We only do one more activity. Okay. Uh, by the way, por cierto. No, not yet. Uh, ¿Quién tiene la sesión ahora? Who has the session today? Uh, me, Zulma. Okay, ready, right? No. <laughs> oh, my goodness, don't say no, please. You're not ready? I am no teacher. <laughs> All right, let's see. Ada? Present. Adriana? Ana Michelle? She's saying present. Angela? Present, teacher. Darwin? Present, teacher. Flor? Gloria? Gloria? Here. Okay. Joanna? Joanna, not present. Um, Lourdes? Present. Margarita? I'm here. Mayra? Present. Miguel? Present, teacher. Nelson? Present teacher. Ophelia? Ophelia? Yes, okay. Yes, Osmin? Present teacher. Rafael? Present. Rosa? Present. Sandra? Present teacher. Jancy? Present. Ulma? Present. Azalia? Present. Ingrid? Present teacher. And Susan. Susan? Susan, she's not connected. Okay. Se durmió. Se durmió Susan. No se desconectó, está desconectada. Okay, so uh, let's go to the last activity. Vamos a la última actividad. Eight minutes. All right. So in this last activity, in this last activity, on page number 32, we have some vocabulary, okay? On page number 32, we have some vocabulary. Está relacionado, para que vean que está fácil. Okay, está relacionado con, lo, con la lectura. So we have, for example, surveillance, reassure, behavior, theft, rage, thief, and spooky, all right? Yes? Van a buscar la mejor definición y escriben el número. For example, the way someone acts. What is the best word for this? The way someone acts. La forma que alguien actúa. What is the, the word? Behavior. 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 So this is number three. Okay, continue con las demás. Cinco minutos. Five minutes. Continue with the others. Five minutes. Ay, no encuentro mi página, teacher. Si tienen... teacher con usted. Ya se durmió mi página. Si tienen la fotocopia, pueden hacerlo en la fotocopia, okay? You can do it on the photocopy. Okay? If not, you can do it on your notebook. Si no, lo pueden hacer en su cuaderno. Five minutes. What is page, teacher? What is? Page. page? Ah, 32. 32. 32. Page 32. Creo que ya estoy dormida, por eso no lo encuentro, teacher. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Wake up. Wake up. <laughs> Hoy no tengo sueño. Oh, nice. <risa> Hoy no tiene sueño, pero está perdida. Nos quedamos hasta las diez y media, entonces. <risa> Angie. Me van a, a dar, ¿cómo se llama? No voy a castigar a los chicos. <risa> Teacher, this, this unit is going to be very heavy. <risa> The next unit? This unit is going to be very heavy. <laughs> it's actually, yes, it's somehow heavy. 
Because of the content. ¿Y cómo les ha salido en la plataforma? Nice, teacher. ¿No les ha salido lo que hemos visto? Uh, this works. Yes. Ah, yes. oh, okay. Yes. Okay. que estoy dormida, no la encontraba, pero ya la encontré, Oh my goodness. Y yo decía que estaba bien despierta. Ya la encontré. Okay. Okay, okay. Finish. Oh, qué rápido. Great. Veo que sí manejan bien el vocabulario ya. Yeah? I can see you manage the vocabulary very well. Excellent. Really? Okay, two minutes. Don't teach her. Don't teach her. Okay, we are checking in a moment. <laughs> We're sleeping, teacher. No, don't. <laughs> Okay, um, okay, let's check. Okay, let's check. Okay, let's see. Uh, Rafael, surveillance. What do you have for surveillance, Rafael? Surveillance is the act of watching someone closely to detect a crime. Good, so it's surveillance is the act of watching someone closely to detect a crime. Ingrid, reassure. Mm, to remove some uh, someone doubt and the, and the fears. Ah, to remove mm -hmm. someone's doubts and fears. Fears. And fears. Tienen, lo, uh -huh. ¿Tienen lo mismo los demás? Do you have the same, everybody? Yes. 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 Okay, perfect. Behavior. Angela. Oh, Behavior. Behavior. Um, um, <clears throat> Oh, moment, teacher. Eh, ese no le he hecho. Me, teacher. The, the, okay. way, the way, way someone acts. The way someone acts. What? Okay. Acts. The way someone acts. Nelson, Tef. Tef, Nelson. Ah, la tenía equivocada yo. Chef Nelson, the microphone, the microphone Nelson, the microphone. Teacher, si la tenía, si la tenía. Okay. Nelson, the microphone. El micrófono Nelson, the microphone Nelson. Wow, thank you. It's okay, Chef. I sleep him. The action of crime of stealing, stealing. Ah, the action or crime of. Stealing, okay, stealing. the action of crime or of stealing. Okay, thank you, Nelson. Okay, okay. Uh, let's see, uh, Gloria, wage. Gloria, wage. Okay. The amount of money spent to... Si no estamos participan participando, apaguemos micrófono, por favor, please, okay. Porque tengo que estarlo haciendo yo aquí a cada rato. El que participe enciende el micrófono, please, okay, para que no haya interferencia. 
Please, okay, por favor. Teacher. Please, okay. Um, okay. Uh, so uh, let's see, Gloria, can you repeat ways, please? Okay. Uh, number five, the amount of money paid to an, an employee. Okay, that's excellent. Uh, Rosa, tip. Tip, tip number yeah, four. Yeah, tip, tip number six, tip. Ah, that tip, sorry. Uh, to give a small amount of money to someone who, ha who has provided a service. Provided a service, excellent, okay. And the last one, Zulma, spooky. A spooky, sometimes that cases fear or nervousness is is fear, all right? Something that causes fear or nervousness is spooky, all right? Is a spooky. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you very much. Eh, solo antes de que nos vayamos, solo quiero hacer un comentario. No me, no me tardé más de 30 segundos, creo. Um, bueno, no lo hago por lo que están ahorita de, de oyente, ¿verdad? Con la cámara encendida. Pero veo que muchos nos hemos acostumbrado a estar ya con la cámara apagada y ya se volvió una costumbre para muchos, ¿ok? No lo hago por los que están, repito. Y eso no es bueno, ¿ok? That's not ok, eso no es bueno. Eh, de, hecho, de hecho, nos pueden llamar la atención por eso, ¿ok? Porque hay un requisito desde el principio, que la cámara debe estar encendida, ¿verdad? Eh, yo sé que hay algunos que a veces están, están en reunión y en este caso se entiende porque me lo dicen, ¿verdad? Eh, pero a veces no están en reunión y no han anunciado nada y están con la cámara apagada. Ok, y a veces solo es un momentito algunos que están cenando o están haciendo algo, van al baño, está bien, ok, pero permanecer un buen rato con la cámara apagada, sí, no, por eso se dan los lineamientos al principio, ok, y lo digo ahorita en general porque no me gusta estarlo diciendo siempre en la clase, ok, porque no sé, siento bien penoso estarles diciendo a veces, ok, ah, siento pena, perdón, siento pena estarles diciendo a veces en la clase, Así que, eh, bueno, para esta semana que viene al menos, y si no estamos en reunión eh, o si no hay razón para tenerla apagada, sí le voy a pedir que por favor tengamos la cámara encendida. ¿Ok? Please, okay. por favor. Okay. 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 En okay. este caso, teacher, me disculpo y yes, okay. lo voy a repetir porque siempre que uso el celular tengo que acercarlo para poder ver el, el libro. Entonces sí. tengo que apagar la cámara porque se me van a ver los grandes sí. ojos en, la, en el celular. En, sí, en este caso yo entiendo, sí, en este, porque yo sé que algunos se conectan de celular y en el momento que estamos trabajando están viendo el libro. En este caso sí yo entiendo, pues no hay problema. Pero a veces se da el caso de que, no, no en tu caso, ¿verdad? Sino que en general, que no estamos en el libro, a veces se está explicando algo y, está, y estamos con la cámara apagada, ¿ok? Así que no estoy diciendo tú, 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 sino que estoy hablando en términos generales, así que cada quien sabe cómo lo hace, ¿verdad? Sí, Gloria. Preguntas. Yo quisiera pedir una favor a general, este, que todos los que no están participando apaguen el micrófono porque se escucha feísimo, no se le escucha al que está participando. Entonces sí. que tengamos el cuidado de quitar el micrófono. Sí, sí, que todos, sí, sí, de hecho se da la indicación por el sonido ambiente, ¿verdad? Eh, yo sé que en la casa a veces están viendo televisión o a veces están los niños y es parte de... Pero, el, pero siempre que participemos, encendamos el micrófono y rápido lo apagamos. Pero a veces es el caso también que dejan el micrófono encendido por un buen rato y hay un sonido ambiente bien fuerte en la casa. Okay, así que este, tengamos el cuidado siempre, como dice Gloria, de estarlo apagando, porque a veces yo lo hago, pero a veces tengo que ir y te, tengo que estar yendo a veces hasta cinco veces en la clase a apagar el micrófono a todos. Porque si voy uno por uno, me tardo mucho también, ¿verdad? Para que en el momento que participemos, aquí va el micrófono, terminamos nuestra participación y lo apagamos. Ok, estar pendiente de eso. Ok. Muy yes, bien. Teacher. Ok. Yes, ok, ok. Thank you very much for connecting today. See you tomorrow and take care. Good night. See you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Bendiciones a todos. Blessings. Okay, Sulma. I'm sorry that, that I have you late today. Lo siento por yeah. que te, te no, bien no. tarde hoy. I'm sorry. Sí. Eso.
Okay, Tulma. Okay, let's see in case you have uh, questions, doubts about a specific topic. So this is the moment, okay? Okay. Um... Creo que, bueno, hoy me costó un poquito lo de la clase porque ayer no me pude conectar. Entonces, mm. <laughs> I'm sorry. Um, pero estaba viendo lo de show have and who have. Mm -hmm. Entonces, eh, voy a ver el video de la clase de ayer para recordarme eh, ese tema en específico. No, no lo he podido ver. Ok. Sí, básicamente, eh, sí, el, el detalle es que ese tema no estaba tan, tan fácil. Estaba un poquito complicado, uh -huh. porque incluso los que tuvieron él les costó un poquito entenderlo, algunos. Uh -huh. Los que lo entendieron, yo creo que algunos todavía se fueron con un poquito de dudas, se fueron a revisar más sí. otra vez el, el manual. Ya, yeah, uh -huh. básicamente, eh, propósitos, lo que estuvieron trabajando, se usa el should have, el could uh -huh. have, right Y se usa uh -huh. prácticamente para para hablar acerca de, de, de algo que, que, que me arrepiento o alguien se arrepiente, o hablar acerca de remordimiento, que es cuando les decía que usamos el, el if I had, por ejemplo, if I had, si yo hubiese, if I had, uh -huh. que es el pasado participio del verbo have, ok, if I had, y luego un verbo en pasado participio, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, si hubiese, si, tú podrías decir, por ejemplo, si me hubiese conectado ayer, ah, aquí entra el tema, if I had, Connected yesterday. El connect, ese verbo va en pasado participio. Si me hubiese conectado, if I had connected, ¿ok? Y luego es un ejemplo nada más, ¿ok? Solo, uh -huh. solo porque si es un, un ejemplo como más en, en contexto, a veces es más fácil, ¿ok? So, I start, empiezo. If I had connected yesterday, si me hubiese conectado ayer, if I had, eso siempre va, y luego el verbo en pasado participio, ¿ok? Uh -huh. If I had connected yesterday, y luego, en este caso, puedo usar el would o el wouldn't, ¿ok? Uh -huh. Would o wouldn't have. I wouldn't have. Yo no habría. I wouldn't have. Would. Uh -huh. El would. I wouldn't have. Uh, what? Um, or I would have. Mejor. I would have understood the topic. Yo habría entendido el tema. I would uh -huh. have understood the topic. Would have y otra vez el verbo en pasado participio. Y ahora bien, si escribo este ejemplo, me quedaría de, los, de la siguiente manera para que se mire como más, para que lo entiendan. Lo que me quedaba la duda es, o sea, ¿cuál es el significado literal cuando yo digo would have o could have? Ajá, exactamente. Vaya, vaya el ejemplo que te daba ahorita. Uh -huh. El ejemplo que te daba ahorita. Ok, if, if I had. Ok, if I had. Had, y luego va el verbo en pasado participio. Okay, if I had connected, si me hubiese conectado, uh, uh -huh. I would have. Ah, lo que tú me estás preguntando, would have. Este would uh -huh. have se traduce como habría. Yo ah, habría, okay. o no habría, si es negativo, right? Si es wouldn't, ok? Wouldn't. Y luego va otra vez, okay. el, y luego va otra vez el verbo en pasado participio. Okay? Understood, uh -huh. que es el pasado participio de understand, ok? I would have understood the, the class, for example, ¿ok? Yo habría entendido la clase, ¿ok? I would have understood the, the class. So, en general, in general, eh, en la primera oración, if I had, y luego un verbo en pasado participio, lo mismo aquí, would have, y un verbo en pasado participio, ¿ok? Si me ah, hubiese okay. conectado, habría entendido la clase, ¿ok? Uh -huh. ¿Ya? Yeah. O, o podría ah. decir, o, si, o, por ejemplo, si fuera... Él o ella hubiera Ajá. entendido la clase. Ya. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ok. Mm -hmm. Ok. Uh, en, y para el should have y el shouldn't have, um, ahí no se usa el if I had. Ok. Aquí digo directamente, uh, he should have, he should have, Okay, he should have uh, connected yesterday. Okay, he should have connected yesterday. Ah, mm -hmm. should have. Él debió haber, haberse. Okay, él debió haberse conectado ayer. Yeah. Ajá, es como un, como, como una, como, como, arrepenti como arrepentimiento de alguna manera porque 
algo mm -hmm. importante pasó, ok, something important happened, ok. Y también aquí en vez de decir el should, puedo usar el, el could. Pero aquí ya es, tal vez la intención es diferente, porque él pudo haberse conectado y no lo mm -hmm. hizo, puede ser, right? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Ya. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Eh, solo son el, 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 estos solo son ejemplos, ¿ok? <laughs> These are only examples, ¿ok? Uh -huh. okay. ok, so I don't know if you have, it's kind of clear for you or está más sí, o menos claro. creo que no, bueno, los demás han de estar igual porque hicimos el ejercicio y los demás tampoco, no, no lo hicimos así, de hecho. Ah, ok, sí, es que la verdad sí está un poquito complicado. Ajá, lo bueno sería ir a revisar el video otra vez y tratar de practicar un poquito. Uh -huh. Y si tienen dudas, igual me pueden escribir, con gusto les, les contesto, aunque no en el momento tal vez, pero yo les contesto en su momento, ¿ok? Ok, sí, yeah. sí. Ok. Yo creo que es solo eso. Ok, thank you very much, Dan Zulma. Thank you for connecting. Gracias a usted. Ok, ok, now you can go to sleep. Good night. <laughs> thank you. Ok, bye bye.